All right, Tyler Trent, tell me, tell me first of all, what is it like to write about yourself, a subject as serious as this? I mean, you're a sports writer. You're writing about other people. You're writing about you. How? Yeah. What is that process? Uh, you know, it's a different process for sure. Uh, there's definitely a lot of self evaluation that goes into things. Um, I would say for me, it's almost easier to write about myself because I know what I've been through and I know, you know, the experiences that I've had. And so, kind of being able to go back and reflect on those things and write about them is almost easier for me. And in the story, the, the, to me, the most, just the greatest part is that you don't want to leave Purdue. And you, the, the lengths you were willing to go to stay. Why? You don't have been there for a year. How'd that school get into your heart so much? Well, they had done so much for me, you know. I uh, got into extreme lengths. Basically told me that, hey, we know you're in a wheelchair. We know you're uh, disabled. If there is something that is wrong, you tell us and we'll make it right. And they did on several different occasions. And then last thing, the whirlwind. I call it a whirlwind. ESPN wants to fly in, the Sagamore, the diploma. I'm leaving out 40 million things. What is, I mean, only you are experiencing this first person. What's it like? Unreal. Uh, in my mind, undeserving. Uh, other people will say otherwise, but yeah, I don't think it's something that I deserve or uh, need in any, in any way, shape, or form. I'm well, just a kid trying to bring awareness to cancer research. And uh, being receiving these awards just constantly confirms that, you know, that prayer that, that I said over a year ago that I would be able to do that is coming true. You're a beautiful human being, Tyler Trent.